Hi there, Chris here with just a tip for you. In this video, we are gonna create shade washes out of any color. Basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna use Liquitex Flowade, as you can see there. And basically with this product, we can turn any acrylic color into a shade wash. Now this is water-based acrylics. We're gonna use Citadel here just for an example. This is corn red and it's a uh, you know, fairly common color. We're gonna slap a little bit onto our palette. And to turn this into a shade wash, basically we're gonna add one or two drops of Liquitex Flowade. I have it in a dropper style bottle here. And then I'm gonna add a little bit of Vallejo uh, medium here just to thin the color out and uh, uh, maintain a little bit of thinness as well as maintaining it being acrylic and then I'll probably add just a drop of water and basically what happens here is you can turn this basically and you can thin this out even further if you want with a little bit more water or a bit more medium and basically make your own shade wash out of whatever color you have in your collection as you can see here I'm grabbing this little orc boy and basically I'm gonna take this red and I'm just gonna slap it right onto the clothing just to show the um, the surface tension of the wash and as you can see it creeps in into the recesses just like the shade washes we all know and love and as you can see again it's going to accomplish whatever we want and so basically what this should do is open up the doors for you as far as creating whatever color shade wash you want to create you can imagine what have you you can take any color from any water-based acrylic line and do this with this particular product flow aid here i'm just showing quickly an example of using ink as well so you don't even have to use regular old acrylic paints you can use ink and such here I just added the drop I'm gonna add two drops you can see, already see how the fluid reacts with the ink and I'm not even gonna add a bit of water to this or any other mediums I'm just using just the ink and a bit of fluid and I'm gonna turn this color into a shade wash and here you can see I'm just simply gonna lay it right on and again you can see with the surface tension it falls within the recesses it creeps into all the little nooks and crannies and creates all the various effects that we uh, really like and love about shade washes and so you can see here you just simply move it around get into all the little areas you want and it picks all those areas out and of course you can adjust the thickness uh, or thinness however you like for whatever preference of whatever particular model you're doing or whatever kind of effect you're going for but that's it that's creating your own shade washes with whatever color you like mm -hmm.